been in my story and it be shit like that. Uh, All that tough talk, what? You ain't built like that. What? You ain't hop in the shed, man. Bring that shit, man, back. Uh, you ain't been in the... Hey, yo, what up? BL Cannon's motherfuckers gonna be BL Cannon's motherfucker. Like, comment, subscribe, share, dislike, do all that. Do something, but show some love, right? And so I want y'all to understand something, right? When you paying attention to your kids, pay attention to what you respond to. You understand what I'm saying? Because this is what you're psychologically giving them praise for. Um, if your kid, right, comes up to you all day and is like, mama, 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 daddy, mama, mama, daddy, mama, right? All day, right? All day long. And you, like, just be ignoring them, right? And, like, they just start getting irritating to you or whatever, however you feel, right? And then let's say you have an instance where... Because after after you have an annoyance with them, there's a buildup. So there's a tolerance that you're creating. You understand what I'm saying? So when they do something in front of you, when they say, Mama, now you built up this tolerance to where you don't even want to, like, you understand what I'm saying? Like, you can tolerate it now. So you you what you do is away with them when they try to hurry up and tell you something, right? Cause it's like you like you finna tell me what you just told me three seconds ago, right? And so when they tell you something different, right, it puts your mind in a shock and it alters your perception, right? Because you thought you knew what you was talking about. Now here's the kicker, right? When you don't put energy toward what they just showed you, it just shows you where you are. So let's say, right, they just wrote something on the floor, right? And you weren't particularly impressed by it. But but you you didn't tell them that. You was just like, okay, you know what I'm saying? But it was the energy that was be put behind that okay, right? It was very faint. There, was, there wasn't anything that you felt good about. It was just an okay, you know what I'm saying? Whatever. What their conscious mind is still being built. So they subconsciously, I mean, their subconscious mind is still being built. So they subconsciously register that. I mean, they consciously register that as um, some type of form of um, attention, right? And so when they do something bad, right, and you like, let's say they about to jump off, off the couch and you hurry up and run in the room and you like, get off of that couch. I told you to stop playing, right? When you do that, how much energy was given toward that? So it shows where you are psychologically, right? You're responding more, you put more energy toward a negative toward a negative situation versus something positive. And I know it's it's frustrating to hear because you didn't a lot of y'all aren't aware that y'all are doing it, but you have this is why you need to slow down and start to pay attention to everything you get mad at and furious with because what you're doing is you understand what you're uh, 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 you're giving them praise for for um basically negative behavior you understand what i'm saying and this what develops a this is what develops in a in a child's mind this is this develops as psychological um basically abuse like you've been psychologically abusing this child anyway but what i'm saying is um their mind is now okay with this you understand what i'm saying this you have been teaching them to um pretty much do negative stuff i i just don't know how else to put it you know what i'm saying i'm just trying to put it into the most simple way i can you know what i'm saying what i'm saying because it's like bro we have to start realizing that bro it's the little things that we doing that's ruining these ch these children's experiences you understand what i'm saying you ruining your child's experience without them even knowing so now they when they get to this dating stage, they looking around like, you understand what I'm saying? It's weird. You feel me? They can't have a functioning relationship because they weren't taught that. You understand what I'm saying? So you have to be aware of what you're giving praise to, because you could be giving praise. You could be you could be enabling them. That's what I'm saying. Y'all got to stop enabling y'all kids. When y'all do specific things, y'all be enabling y'all kids, and y'all wondering why y'all kids is growing up. With the way you didn't want them to grow up, 